YouTube, well, before I show the video of the mayan that I caught, this the huge mayan that I caught, just wanted to say that it, I'm pretty sure that the mayan lived and it swam off. Just to clear any questions about that, um, it didn't, you know, pretty sure it swam off, but it swam, well, I'm pretty sure it was safe because it swam off into the, like all the plants and I couldn't see where it went. And yeah, I'm pretty sure it got, it went back to normal, it was just stressed, so that's why it was like, you know. So yeah, please enjoy the video, and yeah. Here's this monster mine cichlid. This is like the biggest one I've ever caught in, ever seen. Probably like 12, no, yeah, maybe like 10 to 12 inches. It's huge. I mean, watch, it's like the, it's bigger than my hand. Look. Wish I brought my measuring tape, but yeah. Well, I got. Oh God. I saw a gar a few minutes ago. He's nice. This is a nice guy. Well, I got a release, and look how big his jaw is. How big his mouth is. This is a big Mayan cichlid. Yeah. So that's it. Here he is, I got him back in the water. He's just recuperating this huge mine cichlid. Um, gosh, wish I could get a comparison size, but this is huge. He's out of the water for a while, so that's why he's just sitting there. Should dirt off in a few minutes, or not minutes, but a few seconds, you know. He's really nice. Big <laughs> yeah, I just never seen one like this before. Or like this size. Never caught one this size either. Yeah, about 14 inches or so. There's like little mosquito fish biting on him. I don't know if you could see that. There's, they're right there. Get better. Yeah, okay, well, that's, that's. Oh, God. Well, he's over there panicking. He should be fine, anyway.